Hello, everybody. I'm Martin Tyler. Alongside me, the familiar voice of Alan Smith. Yeah, this should be a cracker today. Really looking forward to it. And the lineup for Paris Saint-Germain. We had a five-year plan at Paris Saint-Germain, which was up at the end of the 15-16 season. Of course, they're so dominant in their own country. Can't quite make that final step into the elite winner's enclosure, if you like, in uh, Europe. No, but it takes time, doesn't it? We've seen that with Manchester City. But uh, with the money behind them, it's not going to be too long, I think, until we see them in a European final, perhaps lifting it. Paris Saint-Germain, this is their line. In goal, Kevin Trapp. Thiago Silva plays alongside David Luiz in the heart of the defence. Edinson Cavani is the main striker today. This is the starting lineup today. Well, we've gone with a 4 3 3 formation here for them. Is that the way you see it, Alan? Yeah, I mean, it can be adjusted. It could almost be a 4 5 1 if they decide to come over all defensive, this team. But uh, if they're on the front foot, that three up front can cause the opposition back four some problems. Thank you, Stamford Bridge. Enjoy the game. And our match official, Benoit Tayad. What's this game going to bring us? We'll find out very shortly now, won't we? Because the game is underway. Could be dangerous. David Luiz. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Here's a chance to attack. Well, he's threaded the pass through neatly. Let in the shot go! They've gone for a corner. a problem until the clearance was made. Aurier, David Luiz, Thiago Silva, Matuidi, got the tackle in. The pass not completed, really. Angel Di Maria. How about that, Alan? Oh, lovely to watch. There's good progress with this attack. Nicely played through ball. He's got his shot off now. He's turned it on to the frame of the goal. Well, it is a goal. It is an own goal. I don't think there's much doubt about that, Alan. No, none at all. You're in those positions so often, and sometimes it does go wrong. Bad enough to be behind now, but to do it with an own goal 
It's particularly annoying for the team and the player in question. <laughs> Referee sees that as a foul, and it is a free kick. Well, that's risky going in like that. When you attempt to slide tackle like that, you've got to time it perfectly, and he didn't. Attacking now. Angel Di Maria. Here the challenge is a good one. And the side able to dwell on the ball for very long here. And he could get away here. Cavani! Superb work to reach that great technique and great belief to feel that he could stop the goal. You love looking at goals, Martin, but there's something special about a defender showing those kind of defensive instincts. Throw in for Paris Saint-Germain. Maxwell. Matuidi. Angel Di Maria. Well, good through ball. On for Kabat. And now the shot! Great stop. Just one or two uh, anxious shouts from the Paris Saint Germain bench. Pleased, I'm sure, down there that the team are leading. But they're not really dominating in this game. Two suggestions that the second half might be a problem for them. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. It's good work between these two. Shot on! Referee's given a corner. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Well, the referee has signalled for half-time, and it's 1-0 here. Poor first half for the losing team, really. And that own goal rather rubbed salt in their wounds. Indeed, shot themselves in the foot against a team who doesn't need any help normally, so got a bit of work to do here. chance to attack at least threaded the path through neatly let in the shot go <laughs> nicely played through ball he's got his shot off now well, he's turned it on to the frame of the goal A substitute coming on to try and repair the damage now. Maxwell Corn to be replaced by number 11, Rashid Geza.
We're at the start of the second half, and it's Paris Saint-Germain who hold the advantage at this point. Matuidi, not rushing it here, moving from one side to the other. He went in well. Well, that was looking good, and now it's turned over, and all the potential of that attacking play is lost, and they now got to get back and try and make sure they don't concede themselves. Great interception. And it is time for a substitution in this match. Trying to find an opening. Not panicking. Referee has pointed for a corner. Well, there's going to be an alteration now, and with the team trailing, you can understand why he's going to make it. Corner goes straight to the opposition. Angel Di Maria. We oh, could be in. And he goes on goal. Cavani! Goal! They lead by two now. Took the chance nicely. And that really has given them much more of a basis for the rest of this match. Well, it's a very good goal and much deserved the way the team are playing. Yeah, the stats don't lie, the number of shots on target. No surprise that they've scored. Just widen the margin here to 2-0. Number nine, Edinson Cavani. Building steadily here, keeping possession. Comes in strongly. There's going to be a throw-in after that tackle. It was good progress with this attack. Here's an opportunity. In with a chance. Back into play off the crossbar. Paris Saint-Germain given the throw. Substitution for Lille. Coming off the pitch. Substitution and time. Sergio Dano. Coming onto the pitch. Lille. Coming to Lille. Gregor Krikowiak. Matuidi. There's some potential in this move. And that ball belongs to the goalkeeper. now that's how to tackle referees awarded the free kick for Paris Saint-Germain been good stuff from Paris Saint-Germain and that's much appreciated by those who are backing them well they're gonna need the fans in the coming years when they're spending money trying to compete with Europe's elite Throw it. Here's a chance to attack. And in goes the cross. Well, they got it wide very well, the chance to get the cross in, but it's not turned out to be a very good delivery.
Nyanga on Biwa. Great work from the goalkeeper. Time ticking on. Just over 15 minutes to go. Javier Pastore. Tackle goes in. Good players, they've got Paris Saint-Germain. You've seen them to their best advantage, really, in periods of this game. A game that they seem certain to win now. Well, this is going to be the introduction of three new players. And on the clock, eight more minutes. On the attack here. He'll need to try and get the ball back now. Trying to thread it through here. That's a great interception. And Tweedy into the attacking third. Good through pass. Well, it's not over yet because we've got four more minutes of added time to come. Have a little back heel. The score! Maxwell. Goal! Well, they've taken the low route here. And they've got themselves a goal well out of the keeper's reach. It's another late goal to emphasise the gulf between the two sides today. Yeah, and it's been that type of match. I think everybody out there, the strikers particularly, want to increase the goal tallies. And they've done it. They've widened the margin now. 3-0 they lead. Number 17. Victory for Paris Saint-Germain today. Well, we've seen a game here, Alan, where one team has had the ball and the other team hasn't. Yeah, there was, uh, there was a golfing class out there today, which was surprising given the two sets of players. Wasn't expecting him. Well, he's had a very good game, hasn't he? Got himself a goal and uh, put in a really good shift. Excellent performance. Here's a chance to attack. Well, he's threaded the pass through neatly. Letting the shot go! <laughs> Nicely played through ball. He's got his shot off now. Well, he's turned it on to the frame of the goal. Could be in. And he goes on goal. Cavani!
Here's an opportunity. In with a chance. Clever little back heel. Hit the score! Maxwell.